I wouldn't be surprised for a Kirby game. It's been a the couple Kirby years one. since the last good one. Um, the most recent one was the All the, the what is it called? Star Allies is the most recent like yeah, full game and there's Allies. Kirby Clash or whatever. Oh yeah, Kirby Clash. Kirby like, too, side games. Which just came yep. out of, like a I mean Star Allies is like a mainline game. Yeah, but that one came out like pretty early in the Switch. I'm gonna switch controls real quick. So I'm back. Um oh I'm back. Okay, so yeah, Kirby left field, uh I actually would not be surprised as left field if they threw something Star Foxy at us. Um, not necessarily like yeah, a new new game, but I could yeah, see. If you want to talk left field Star Fox? It's definitely one of them. Honestly, the weirdest thing that I is definitely not gonna happen, but I would love yeah. to see something come back. It would absolutely be uh, a return of um, uh, Punch Out. Didn't they? Punch mm. out like it's not gonna happen. I feel We're like not it, getting a new punch out. Yeah, right? same with same with things like F. Like I feel like F Zero. F Zero is the last game. This is a constant game. thing of like I know it's a constant <laughs> thing of like At least punch it's out never coming out, and yet at the same time he's so fucking popular from Smash that it's almost yeah. like why hasn't there been some kind of how was Kid Icarus? But it's like how is how has Pit gotten a game before Falcon? Uh, well, because, okay, so they, because they brought... Well, I know, they kind of added that in yeah, as, like, they, a... they brought him back to make the yeah. game, essentially, because it was in yeah. the books. It was, a, it was a planned game, or a planned title. Mm -hmm. Um, but, of course, that was not the case for, uh, <laughs> F-Zero. <laughs> Which, I mean, to be fair, yeah. like, when, you know, the initial Smash came out, 64 had F-Zero on it. It was one of its mainstay titles. And then mm -hmm. when the you know when Melee came out, they didn't want to drop any of the core initial characters, and they still had another game to give. And then <laughs> Brawl and Onward, the only thing we haven't in terms of like the games that have dropped characters like Melee to Brawl and uh, Brawl to Four Wii U, the one thing that hasn't changed is the core initial twelve characters have been in mm. every game since. Like without oh, fail. Here's one. Yeah. Because it is a Zelda anniversary, they're going. Uh, uh, we're just going to get like Four Swords Adventures. Four Swords Adventures. Okay. Nice. They release it for the 25th anniversary. People have been joking. Oh well, you know, 35th's not as important. <laughs> wait, wait. What does that say for Mario? Uh, it's 35th anniversary. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, like, they're all in the same. I fucking Metroid and Zelda and Mario apparently all have the same <laughs> anniversary this year. Yeah. I didn't realize they all came out in the same fucking year. Yeah, I mean, I think the Mario um, anniversary is referring to the first Mario game, not like when Jumpman debuted. Yeah, that's that's what I mean. H hence the yeah, hence that. Um, so I guess that, to a degree, makes some sense. But people have always also been like, well, I mean, you know, the twenty fifth anniversary is a bigger deal, and Zelda got nothing. They yeah. got. Hey guys, we're putting, uh, we're giving you guys Four Swords Adventures for free on DS, yeah, or 3DS. Really? Well, it's because you know Zelda, for being considered a flagship Nintendo property, really isn't a big Nintendo property. It's just one of its mainstay characters, I guess. I was about to say, isn't isn't it's, it like the number three? Yeah, in terms of sales. Probably, but uh, it just seems like it's never been Nintendo's like, in, in terms of like not sales, but like in terms of their. Like creative team, it's never seemed like a priority for them. Um, why that I is, I can't tell that. you, but uh, it just never felt like a like this is the one of their big oh. biggest franchise kind of deals. Even though it it actually no, is. See, see, I disagree because I feel like if it was one of their well, this is their biggest franchises, they would have had out breath. They would have rushed Breath of the Wild out a lot sooner to capitalize on no, trying to kind of rush out the Wii U, Wii U version. Well, they worked on the Wii U version before the Switch. I remember when that was first announced, it was purely Wii U. Uh, um, oh, was it? Yeah, that was announced like five years before <laughs> it came out or something. Pretty shitty version. <laughs> I remember that. It's, yeah. But, um, I mean, I would think if it was like, this is just money, we don't really like 
care about it creatively, they wouldn't have they would have put it out to try and prop the Wii U up by any means possible. You know what I mean? I mean, I know a rush game will be a bad game type shit, but you know. Breath of the Wild is I hear is good. I know it has a fuck ton of flaws. Oh, have <laughs> you ever played it? I've not played it. No. I will say I am purely in the camp of I like it. I don't think it's the second coming of gaming Jesus, but that's what it says it is. Yeah, like I, I like that the, there's only two sides. There's like it's a it's either like a clunky mess or it is uh, the greatest Zelda game, possibly greatest RPG ever made. Like it's always really pushed yeah. up the like all the way at the top. Uh, it really is, and like, like, like my thing, I like it for what it is. Um, it definitely feels like it has a pretty a good open world. Not a huge fan of the way the weapon destruction system works, but it's not. I mean, it's oh, not terrible. I wish the oh yeah, I see that. Wish the music was a little better, or uh, just don't really like the main. Another information like what might change, but obviously okay. Not. Last thing, I miss I miss traditional Zelda uh, dungeon quests. By the way, that's true. There's no like actual dungeons in it. The shrines are like nothing like an actual Zelda dungeon. Yeah, <laughs> and the one that the animals are kind of like not just actual gameplay yeah. footage. Okay. None of them have their own identity, visual identity. Oh, Maybe. Xenoblade. What? Are you guys ahead of me? I'm just watching live. I'm watching live on my PlayStation, but I haven't seen Xenoblade or anything pop up. I'm watching on YouTube. <laughs> Me too. On the YouTube theory. app on PlayStation. Yeah. Oh, shit. Maybe I should switch. It looks like... Well, it definitely looks like it's HD Xenoblade Chronicles 2, so I'm, I'm having a feeling we're getting... Xenoblade Chronicles 2 HD or whatever on the Switch, which, you know, it's great. Well, that would mean, I mean, yeah. I don't know. I mean, that would mean the, the uh, things about getting a Switch HD might be legit. I know with the Fire Emblem rumors, that was another idea of why, because they were seeing that some of the models were higher fidelity. Oh my god, the awful, I forgot about the awful voice acting. <laughs> There's a lot of I forgot how terrible the voice acting in that game is. Right, like I'm watching it. Like okay, yeah, wow, you guys are way ahead of me on the PlayStation. I'm switching. Yeah. This is where you were. Hey, Akira. <laughs> oh, shit! I had what? a feeling. I had a feeling we were going to get Xenoblade 2 at some point in Smash. Kira, though. Interesting. Kira, really? I thought I was going to be in Smash Bros. Huh. Wow, that's... And so I'm wondering, I wonder if it's like a it's Joker enough. thing where you transform, or if it's like, I don't know, I haven't played two yet. I still gotta finish yeah, one. I don't know much about it. I'm curious if it's just. Like, I know that an they're. RPG I feel. Party thing. Yeah, it's an RPG party no, thing. No, I'm pretty like, sure that they're like. like oh, no, they're I wouldn't so heard of Xenoblade. I think they're actually related in that way. Like, they're like the same person. Oh, I'll be right back. Oh, yeah, they do this. Yeah. They're gonna do the Zelda Sheik thing. Okay, I'll get in a minute. Okay. 
sorry. <laughs> of course, all the cats are in the background of the stage. That's always fun. Yep. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. And okay. Rex so she is the Zelda. Oh, and Rex is part of the the super. That's always fun. That is pretty cool. Oh, and she he has a unique super based on which character you are at the time. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's cool. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, it's definitely a Zelda Sheik thing. Oh, hi, Shmo. Oh, did you show up in two? Huh. It's kind of weird how different their character designs look now that they're both on Switch. Yeah, that's cool. I'm really happy on this one, actually. Yeah, let's go. So I'm wondering if she's going to be more like Joker, where... She's nah, they, that was, she that was definitely the that was definitely a Zelda Sheik thing. Two of different being able oh, to Zelda switch Sheik. whenever you want. Okay. Because she was switching way too okay. often. That's true. Ooh, let's find out. Hi, Shinya. Shinya Takahashi. You delivered a new Switch series for Nintendo Direct Mini Pro Paper. You haven't been able to compete. However, you haven't been able to present the Nintendo Direct Well, fans of that leaker in Suicide Watch. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, let's make all of it wrong. I love that. Yeah, it was a good you do. I didn't hear about it at all. I'm way more for surprises than I am for... For that. You know, me too. Okay, you know what? Oh, you guys aren't catching any of this coming back, like, no, feedback on my mic. No, I definitely can hear it. I can definitely hear it coming in from your Sorry. <laughs> it's like a second farther than I am. How are you guys watching it on the computer and not and streaming on PlayStation? And not getting your feedback. <gasps> I'm Ooh. Oh, Fall oh, Fall Guys. Okay. Nice. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Fall Guys. It makes sense. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, did he mention anything about, like, a release date for Pura? Yeah, March. He said March. Okay. Oh, you know what? I wonder if Pinkman 4 is going to be announced. Alright, so are you catching any of what's happening now, feedback-wise? I can, like, hear it, but I can't tell what it's saying. Damn it. How are you guys not getting feedback on your end? Because I, I told you guys, I play my PS4 on my computer. Oh... So the sound is still coming from my headset. So yeah, it's yeah. not playing on the other side. Yeah, yeah. I don't have my PS4 hooked up to my computer. Well, I actually don't have my PS4 connected to my computer either. There's a program online where you can uh, remote control your PS4 if you need to. I just plug in my PS4 oh. controller in it in my computer. And play. Yeah, this is how I've been playing my PS4 the past 10, 4 weeks. Okay. Oh. Hmm. Oh, we meant to see there was a Famicom games. What if this randomly becomes one of those like big video game threat, like the Among Us of a Nintendo Direct type thing. Ooh. Oh god. Ghosts don't exist here. 
together we could have none of it. And I had a way of putting people out who the culprit is before they even went to the next town. Oh, it's a horror game. It's a really old horror game. Ooh. I still can't think of Okami. Fire Emblem? Oh, Dynasty. Nobunaga Oda. Why you make me wait? You think I'm the most ever you? Oh, that Kenshi, you should be there. Oh, Samurai. Oh. Oh, Samurai Warrior. Yeah, okay. Five, wow. We haven't seen one of those for a while. Surprising we, we hear about it for is this the one that Adam was pretty obsessed about? Like, yeah, for a short minute there. Yeah, like, just a. You should text Natsuki screaming. Yeah, I kind of gave up on the crowd fighter game. I've only. I've never really been big on them, but I will try Persona 5 Strikers after I finish Royal. Study? Oh, Legend of Mana, okay. Oh. Looks like it was, uh, is it remastered a little bit too, or is it like, like the... I don't, yeah, I was about to say. Man has been getting a lot of attention lately. Which it should, because it's fantastic. Yeah. And the fact that, like, it doesn't get the love that Chrono... Like, it, it falls in between Chrono Trigger and Earthbound as the big Super Nintendo RPG. Yeah. But, like, Man is fantastic. I feel like it just gets outshined by Chrono and Final Fantasy more than anything. Yeah, it's true. I don't know. People talk about Earthbound a lot. They do, but I feel like... I don't know. I, don't, I haven't played Mana, but just Earthbound just has its own such like a unique vibe. When I think Legend of Mana, I really compare it more to things like Final Fantasy and stuff. Okay. Oh, ooh, is this Monster Hunter? Yep. Yeah, that's definitely Monster. <laughs> I just had to see one for him. I was like, yeah, that's Monster Hunter. Yeah, I was like, I was like, there's sharks in the ground. That's Monster Hunter. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there's some. Capcom presents. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, a new spider. <gasps> Does this mean their cello's coming back? That'd be amazing. We're getting, dude, this is huge because we're getting insects back then. Into the, because they'll have insect, uh, okay, we knew Basarius was coming back. Well, that's a yeah. Basarius. Cool, that's a cool monster. Volvodon. Basarius we knew was coming back because he, he shared, uh, they'd be seen as armor in the earlier trailer. But yeah, that spider's cool, and dude, I've been wanting to see uh, Nursilla. Ooh. Oh, oh one I more like month. He looks Ooh. really cool. Looks like Mud Dragon. Let's go. I think it's so sick. Al Nudron. Oh, stop talking. I have important news. Yay. Awful story that I don't, that no one cares about. It has me shook how big Mad Namalo actually is. Oh, the big, uh, Japanese Yeah, the main guy. Yeah. yeah, he doesn't look like he should be very big, and then, like, at the end of the last fucking trailer, he was holding a goddamn Toby Kodachi as mouth like a chew toy. Yeah, all these freaking dragons. Yeah. Oh, Keizu. There's Keizu. That was, oh, have, God. I still haven't de decided what weapon I'm gonna use. I'm probably gonna at least start through on Hunting Horn. It's always been Bay, and now they gave it the upgrade it needs. 
Ooh. Apex. Oh, they're bringing Apex monsters in. I think those were back in GA as well. Are, it's, it's, a, it's just a bear. Apex bear. It's Apex, Apex bear. predator. The Apex tier bear. Yeah, I'll probably jump on it just because I know everyone else is. Yeah. I prepared for this to be my new obsession for the next couple months. Oh, oh. Oh, hey, you're you get to see them do now. shit. They mentioned in a trailer that, like, basically everyone in that village trains to fight. What? Yeah, we already knew that. that Fuck. Was, that was already the rumor. Well, we knew it was in Japan. This was the first time it's been announced for America. Oh, I thought that was always That's the thing. This is, no. This is the first time they gave it an American, uh, release. Fucking shit. Well, that Pro Controller's coming out. Ooh. I feel like it's ah, only used, though. Damn it. But, like, it's such a huh? hard weapon when you're on your own. What is the bow. The bow. Uh, like, depends, yeah, weapon. but I mean... You kind of need ooh. to run with other people. My own call. <laughs> We're bringing ah, dude, Mario not Go. really, actually. The, Let's go. All of, at least in World, all of the ranged weapons were like top five like speed runners. Let's go. Like solo. We haven't... See, I've been saying that, man. We, when we were remade... Uh, we got the remake of Mario Tennis. I was like, dude, where are all the other weird Mario sports games from like the game? I era? want Strikers, man. Another soccer? I didn't like the last one yeah. that much, the Wii one. I didn't get a chance to play them, but like soccer has always been kind of like the sport I'd be most interested in. I can't wait till we get Mario Swim. I mean, they already gave Mario, they already Mario gave, got Mario his swimsuit. Ooh, yeah. was that something on the Wii versions? Was there a Wii version of this? Yeah, yeah. Oh, Mario Golf? No, no. Mario Golf, the last no. one was on GameCube. Actually, no, GameCube? Think, wow. Yeah, it was GameCube. Well, that was like the sports era. Mario had a bunch of, like, had baseball, it was, yeah. soccer, um, golf. Oh, you can, <laughs> you can run around the field, too. What? I'm okay, so, ten so, out of ten. We yeah, got so ready for Speed <laughs> golf. Oh, shit. I'm so, I want this so much now. Dude. That sounds so fun. Me, too. Oh, and you gotta race to your ball and play so, <laughs> so you can get there first? Speed yeah. Speed ball? I want that so much. Oh. Cool. I want to yeah. see some of these in the next Smash game. Turn like, I want to see Princess Peach be able to ice skate around and literally shit. Literally turn Mario into a party, or golf into a party game. Only Mario could do it and make everyone happy. Oh, you can oh dude, use your, use your own me in, sp and in a, a story, story mode. mode. Yeah, I'll be playing Mario. Let's okay. go. Mario yeah. Tennis really bummed me out. It releases to tonight. <laughs> that would be insane. I highly doubt it. <laughs> you know what? One of these will be. One of I, these I, that's just one my of prediction. Them. One of the games that they announced today will be a It's Out Tonight. <gasps> just for my birthday. Just in time. Okay. That's cool. Shame. Yeah, I, I was hoping it wouldn't be this soon. Kind of him. Yeah, actually, me too. Like the story mode golf or yeah. the, the multiplayer golf is such Honestly, a speed golf sounds like the such a fresh game. take on it. Yeah, let's go. Like I don't think I've really seen a golf game with More multiplayer. Switch headline. Like not like that. Check out these games on your Switch. Borderlands 3 for Switch? Tales from Borderlands, okay. I still won't be playing it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Tales of the Borderlands, the Telltale games. Yeah. This game is like $2 everywhere else. It's gonna come out for like 50 40 Yeah, I was never a fan of the Telltale games or the Borderlands games, so I'll try. Capcom Arcade Stereo. I could see you being interested in that. I feel like Axton's gonna get this game. Yeah, he would be getting this one. 100%. Great game, great shooter. Ghosts and Goblins. Aren't they releasing a remaster of Ghosts and Goblins? Uh, yes, they are, actually. No, they already released it. Is that on oh, Switch? Street Fighter or 2 is on here, too. Let's go. And yes, Strider. Strider's so good. What? Dinosaur Wars. Uh, oh. <gasps> I've 
never no, heard of this. Stud the Zombie is coming back. Okay, Stud the Zombie was an Xbox exclusive zombie game where it was like a puzzle, like fuck, like joke game, and it l looked so fun. But it was like only on Xbox. It looks only on Xbox awesome. and really hard to get. And now it's on Switch. That's awesome. I can't wait for that. It looks fucking. It looks fun. It reminds me a lot. I feel of, throw my literal hand through. Oh, reminds me of Andy here's that trap. Yeah, see, I called it. I knew we were gonna get something. Yep. Tonight. That would that would be really weird. Anyway, it would. But I mean. Oh, I like the switch controller on his hand. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, God, that amazes me. I need to go get the No More Hero games and finally play through them. Oh, it looks so cool. Please, oh, you know what? You know what? Say, give us a release date, please. And then say, No More Heroes. Oh, no, wait. No More Heroes 1 2 already did release on Switch, no? Yeah, they did. Yeah. So they can't I need to that again. buy them and play them. Oh, for a second, it was like Fatal Frame? Oh, my God. Oh. It's got so many re There's <laughs> Wow, so many references. So many deep cuts. It's very. Yeah. This is No More Heroes. Such a fun, dumb game. I love it. I, this is the newest one. <laughs> yeah, they can't curse on this. <laughs> but, but man, the... August 27th. Oh, we got a date. Oh, yeah. August 27th. Okay. Yeah. We knew it was this year. I, I didn't have, like, have even a guess when it would come out. August 27th. Ooh, is this? Ooh, what is this? For a second, I was like, is this a Shin Megami Tensei game? <laughs> Fine. Oh. <gasps> Hell yeah. It's always a good oh. time when you got <gasps> fucking... <gasps> what is this game? <laughs> this looks so wild. So it's a deck building shooter? Interesting. Whoa, man. This looks fucking sick. Plus, when you oh. got the spectacular voice of uh, Spike as the titular character. <laughs> yeah. Steve Bloom absolutely playing the main character is awesome. Neon White. Interesting. Neon White. Yeah, that looks sick as hell. I honestly kind of wish it was on a different console than <laughs> Switch, but. Winter this year? Okay, so that's a long way. Okay. So. It very well could be, but DC Superhero Girls, huh? Oh. Oh yeah, I heard that was actually gonna be a game. Interesting. Okay, I miss. I totally misread that. The name. Yeah. I'm not even gonna say what I thought it said. Yeah, it's fine. Looks cute. Looks like a little classic beat em up. Yeah. Yeah, I'd play it actually. It just kind of reminds me of Marvel <laughs> Ultimate Alliance, but with the DC superhero girl characters. It feels really old school, but like in a good way. Oh, where it makes me think. It, it takes me back to like. Like GameCube and thing where you have to look for normal lives too. That's fun. I'm down for it. Yeah. Uh oh. Juice cannons. Okay. Is this Plants vs. Zombies? Yes. <laughs> yep. Plants vs. Zombies, but like the, the third person shooter. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Plants vs. Zombies Battle for the Neighborhood. <laughs> Neighborville? Okay. Crap. Comes out March 19th. Yeah. Yep, it's Plants vs. Zombies, but a third person battle royale game. Oh no. No, Battle Blocks, Attack of Mission Kick Is this a third person? Some shooter? grass. Kick some grass offline. 
Oh god, Corn Cop Man. Oh no, Corn Cop Man is juicy, but not in the way I would ever want corn to be. What's up? Yeah. That's what happens when you make billions of dollars. Whoa. Yeah, I'll it's, it's probably fine. Yeah. Like, it looks fine, but like... She's never really been grabbed by Plants vs. Zombies. The fact that it's Plants vs. Zombies uh, makes me not interested. Wait! Is this me adventure thing? Like, like from the 3D? Yeah! Huh. Interesting. Yeah, Metopia. It's, it looks like they're just, they're, you know, it's it's that 3DS, uh, Wii, uh, me game. Huh. They're playing on Switch. Yeah, or, yeah. Yep. So, yeah, it was like a Street Pass game. So it's like a me RPG game, but you play as your me's and the enemies are your me's and stuff. That's fun. Pretty much. That's cool. I like that. It was a pretty nice little time waster on the 3DS. Um, you, it was like I remember on 3DS, it was like whenever you street past someone, they would join your party, I think, or something. I could be totally wrong. I, think. I do remember that though. <clears throat> I'd play it because I'd like to. Absolutely. I'd love to have the garbage gang go on a quest together. Bruh. Bruh. Yes. Yeah, and, and it's just like the real life, where we would try and help each other and then fight instead. And then fuck a horse. Dude, you can fuck a horse? Let's go. <laughs> yeah, you can fall in love with a horse. That's a May 21st. I'm liking all these yeah, early dates. Yeah, I haven't really been upset about any reveal. I guess the Plant vs. Zombies one's pretty lame. But hey, I knew it. I called it. Super Mario themed items. <laughs> oh, for, for Animal Crossing. Okay, yeah. <laughs> That's what you meant. I didn't know what you meant by that. Yeah, sorry, yeah. There was, there was like a... Mario items for Mario. Animal Crossing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's cute. When you use the the wand, it plays the doo 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 doo. That is cute. Whoa, you have a workable swamp. <laughs> you have a working swamp as well. Dude, does the does the, the oh my god, if the pipe works, that's amazing. Hey, oh, dude, it works. <laughs> that's actually useful. So yeah, you can use it to travel from island to island. Oh, it's island to island. I was just thinking it was on your. Yeah, was no, you, on can your have, you can have it on different islands that you that you. Oh, my sisters are gonna be February about this. February twenty fifth. So that's literally next week. Yeah, next uh, yep. Thursday. Yep. And apparently they'll all be at the nook, sh nook shop. Ooh, I seen pink cherry blossom trees. That's correct. They are going back yeah, to the spring the updates spring, soon. Yeah, the spring event soon. God, that event broke me. Yeah, I don't know if I can do it again. Obviously, I don't play Animal Crossing, but uh, Ashley will love it. She also does love her, uh, love her Mario. Uh, uh, oh, what's going on here? Yeah, they just released this, which I still need to buy. I really I do too. So bad. I, same. I never played 3D World because, like, like when I had my Wii U, I literally only played like I didn't play Mario or not Mario. By Wii U. I did. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I know you did. I played Bayonetta Wait, on it actually. <gasps> oh, no way. Is this? Wait. Wait. Oh. Yeah, like HG is this Historia? Or maybe it's oh maybe it's Octopath Traveler too? Oh maybe. Oh yeah, definitely. Ooh, that yeah it is. It is. Interesting. That or it's either that or maybe yeah, it's gotta be Octopath Traveler. Or maybe just like For a second I was like it's either that or it's Bravely Default? I don't think any of these are Bravely Default. Yeah, this has to be it. God, Nintendo, by the way, Nintendo is throwing out, like, so many fucking games I want to buy, like, in a two-month period, because it's like, oh, it's all June Triangle August. Strategy. It's, it's just June between, it's just between 
Dude, I'm Triangle talking right strategy. now. Yeah, Project Triangle Strategy. Between so it's not Mario. Traveler, it's Triangle Strategy. Salt and Iron. Call Isaac. Salt and Iron. Oh. Yeah, it's Salt. <laughs> yeah, the Salt and Iron. Yeah, there's, salt there's and iron. So, um. Salt Iron War. No. What I mean is, like, fuck, I'm talking about right now. Mario. Uh, yeah. got released last week. I think next yeah. week is Bravely Default 2. I put like 80 hours of Bravely Default 1. Love it. And then, you know, Monster Hunters next month. Uh, no, I I actually brought my 3DS out back out because I'd like to play through uh, quite a few games still on there, though. Like, I still need to get through Samus Returns and Battle System. Stuff like that. Yeah, they're really going to break down this game. Oh boy. I have a feel. It looks like they're they're messing around with the battle system. Yeah, I, don't know. I bet it's you it's. Totally, is, oh, it's tur. Oh, it's it's a like, turn-based strategy. Yeah, no, this is one hundred percent like Final Fantasy Tactics or. Uh, Ooh. Yeah, this is one hundred percent just a tactics game. Ooh, Ooh but you can interact I'm with okay the area that. around you. That's pretty cool. That's very different from just strategy play features. Ooh. That's pretty standard for Strategy. Yeah. Yeah, they're doing some fun little different things, but yeah, 100%. I just did graphics, man. I've, yeah, I've right. always loved how, like, this studio's been doing, like, the, like, H, kind of HD-looking like, pixel graphics. Right, so there's, like, a fiery terrain, so you can cast ice to put it out. Cast Ooh. lightning to, to, like, but yeah, that, that's... So, like, it's Dude. not just a strategy RPG, it's, like, a strategy game. You gotta think about it's a, it's a strategy, man. Yeah, it's like a pure strategy. Like you actually have to war strategize Let me guess. because of the scenery and things like that. But you gotta like, but you gotta like uh, play oh, through yeah. sixteen so character storylines. Yeah, what route you want to take? Yeah. Oh God. Yeah, this is gonna be a this is gonna be a rough RPG. <laughs> like this is gonna take some thinking, hardcore. Which party yeah. the members to bring with, and what magic they have, and what, uh, yeah, yeah, this is gonna be a, this is gonna be a RPG. Oh, boy. The oh, scales you choose to mix. surrender, or, yeah, okay. Yeah, this is a, oh, <laughs> this is gonna be a shit. full-on war game. <laughs> this feels, this feels really ambitious. I'm about it. Yeah, this is like a big game. This is the kind of game I, I'm probably gonna pick up and play. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of the reason I like RPG my big RPGs. Like, I feel like RPG fans could re easily get behind because of how big it scales yeah. up. Like, Your journey may take you down a path. Honestly, at this point, it feels like the combat itself is like the lowest point of it. <laughs> Everything else yeah. seems like so big. Working title. Okay, so this is not actually coming out soon. <laughs> no, this is not. This is the, okay, yeah. The Project Triangle 2022. Is the working oh, title. thank God. It gives me time to actually play oh, through yeah, some other games. Not until next year, that makes sense. That game, it, it did look like they... Oh! Cause you, oh, it's, oh, I'm gonna get the demo is out it. today. Today. That looked like they had a lot done, so I'm guessing they don't have yeah. the extra story stuff, different levels. So I assume they're gonna make yeah. this a very big game, which makes sense, too. Yeah, I'm assuming you're basically, they basically got the vertical slice done, and that's what they're giving us as a demo. Cause, yeah, the combat. Okay, let's see a few more Nintendo... Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> More Switch heads. Wait. What do we got? Wait, is this Metro Prime Hunters remake? Is that on Switch? Yeah. No. I was thinking, wondering if it was a Metro Prime Hunters. Or, oh, Star wait. Wars Star Wars title? Yeah, I saw the Storm Trip behind them. Yeah. I just, oh, uh, I just saw like Hunters were like, wait. Oh, shit, are those classes? Oh, shit, what is this? Oh. Dude, is it an online, um... Oh, Star shoot. Wars. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, Zynga. So it's this year. Zynga, though. That makes me, that makes me, okay. um... <laughs> it'll come out this year. We don't know anything yet. Oh, it'll be free. Zynga makes me a little nervous. They're the people who did, like, Mafia Wars and Farmville and all that on Facebook. Yeah, Wait. Blackout City? That guy looks familiar. I feel like this is a phone game, maybe, that they're putting on Switch? Princess Charms already my favorite game. Yep. 
I like ornament. Or <laughs> I like red. Correct, Nar. Uh, <laughs> yeah, cool. Huh. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Okay. I'm a little more interested now. It's 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 Overwatch dodgeball. <laughs> it's competitive <laughs> online dodgeball. That's amazing. Okay. I like dodgeball. This. I love it. That sounds. This is the most Nintendo idea. I love it. Let's I go, Boba Cola. Yeah. This is great. I'm so for this. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Hey, it's. Junkrat. Oh, he can turn. He can turn into the ball. That's. Oh, he can turn other people into the ball. Oh, he can just be. I think that's his special. Too. That's awesome. Captain Wrangler jeans. Captain jeans. Max splints. Max splints. Ooh. The drip in this game. Oh though. yeah. Let's I just go. see Jolene Joestar run by. <laughs> Oh, dude, the garbage game's gotta have like a uniform costume. Bruh. Like we gotta, we gotta have, have something. Like each person. I'm excited because I've been. I'm excited because I feel like like there's some like like. May twenty first. That's pretty soon. Knockout. Story. I just want to. I'm excited to just have more games that we can play together that aren't like Grand Theft Auto and Overwatch and lots of other. That looks like Pokemon. Hey, World's end. Dagen Rapa. Oh, so that guy's dead. World's End Club. Oh, Miss America, okay. No, it's not. I knew that. I just saw it look kind of like it. So, kind of like a visual novel? Yeah, this is totally a visual novel. The game is suddenly called off. Oh, I thought they were going to be like, yeah, this game was cancelled and we brought it back. Oh, side scroller. When side scrolling action is Whoa. a central narrative. This is a weird game. As you make your way back home to Tokyo, you'll alternate between working solo. I don't even know what this game is supposed to be. Uh looks like it's we're running a bicycle on people. World's End Club. I've no clue what this game is. Oh, so this is a cool release of Hayden. Interesting. Physical release of Hades, okay. That's cool. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's, it's, it. Actually, this is the first physical release I think it's ever had. Yeah, because it was like a PC game. Because of Steam and... Yeah, Steam. Ooh. Cool. Yeah. Ooh. It even comes with the... the original if it comes with a really... If it came with a nice steelbook, I, I might like that. Because I quite like the game in its style. Oh. It comes with a PC code to give you the uh, soundtrack. Ooh, yeah. The character compendium? That's pretty sick. I do like that. That is a, he is like a Godzilla artist. That art is so yeah. cool. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that looks Oh, wow, that's nice. That's quick. March 19th. Okay. So a month. Wait, is that? Ooh. Ninja Gaiden? Yeah, it is. Oh, my God. Are we getting the Ninja Gaiden games? Oh, we're getting like Sigma, the Master Collection. Absolutely. And Sigma 3 is not Games I will game. never play because I don't have that kind of skill. Oh, dude, you should play them. Trust me. Don't don't worry about that. They're so fun. Like, God, like they're so fun. You know what? I want to see them put an easy mode in just to trigger the tryhards. So there, like... there already is an easy mode in the game. Oh, there is? Yep. If you die of three times in a row without beating a level, uh, the game will ask you oh, if you shit. want to switch to easy mode. And uh, oh. if you do that, the game is still hard, though I was able to get yeah. very far. I, was pro I probably could beat it. Um, however, the game will never give you a rank higher than Ninja Dog, which is the lowest difficulty. I don't care. I've never cared about ranks. Yeah. I'd be cool with that. Um, Ooh. Okay. This is a. I'm liking this direct. Let's go. Let's go. I love Ninja Gaiden. Those games are so fun. Oh. Age of Calamity DLC. 
The only DLC yeah, I want to see for Age of Calamity is to make it. Um, the only thing I want to see for Age of Calamity is for them to release an update that makes it not tank. Frames per second on the demo, at least. Oh. Show new characters. New weapons. Rost, banded roster, yep. Cool. Comes out May or June. So new weapons, stuff for Link, and then new stuff for Luigi. There's even more coming. Yeah! yeah. Bradley Default 2. Oh, there you go. Default 2 is almost here. Yep. Ooh, it's so pretty looking. Well, outside of the character. Models. Well, all right. Models. Yeah, but like, but like the regular, but like the 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 the, the backgrounds are kind of breathtaking. Okay, the action C or CD action symbols are really bad. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, I still need a place for them. Okay, so final honestly. trailer will come oh. out also available. Uh, after this. So that's the latest. Oh, I, I should mention because you asked me if I played Bravely Second. Yeah. Bravely Default 2 does not is going to be kind of like Final Fantasy game where you won't need the uh, I'm pretty sure you don't need well, to, to play the first games. Oh, we better get the prodigy on this. That's, isn't that Space's character in a cap? In a, is it? I don't know. It could be. No, he likes it. Saga Frontier Remastered? Ugh. I'm pretty sure it's like, rom I, th I think Romancing Saga and stuff like those games? I think that's what this is. They were like PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2 cartridges. I remember correctly. Yeah. Oh, I actually didn't know that it wasn't already on Switch, honestly. Apex. Apex is on Switch. There's, that's definitely a game I wouldn't pick up on Switch. <laughs> yeah. I don't really, I don't even play it now. I definitely don't want to play it on Switch. <laughs> I'm just not big on Battle Royale, so. Yeah. <clears throat> I found only one that I've enjoyed. What was it? Was it Fork Knight? One was Battlegrounds 3. <laughs> oh, no, the new one? one? Yeah, it's pretty funny. I didn't think that was about. Oh, that is Battle Royale. Yeah, it's a cheesy it's Battle Royale game. Look, okay, so I would maybe play that. Oh. Hey, uh. Hey! Oh, hey. Breath of the Wild 2. Producer of the Legend of Zelda game. <laughs> no, we're not gonna. We're gonna get, um. Dude, the if they announced Oracle of Seasons and Ages HD, I would be. Pretty happy. Yeah, unfortunately, we don't have anything to show. So, see, I told you that this game not even yeah. close to not even close to done at all. They plan to have more info this year, so that's it. They don't even have a like an idea when this game's coming out. I told you it's not coming out, man. <laughs> oh, but they have a new Zelda title coming for Switch. Okay. Oh, it's Skyward Sword Remastered. Ooh, I wonder if they're also gonna if they're gonna <laughs> bundle it with Wind Waker and um, Twilight Princess Remastered oh, from the Wii U fun. and just make a collection. That was another big one people had rumored was if not Skyward Sword to have all three uh, of those games yeah. on one package. I, I just heard Skyward Sword was like one of the weakest of the mainline Zelda games. It is. I still enjoy. I mean, it's one of those things where it's the weakest of a series that. Continuously as nine out of ten games, and this is like maybe a seven to an eight. You know what I mean? Right. I don't know. It always seemed more like a six. Really? Nah. That's a little low. <laughs> I will say I Skyward played through Sword it. HD. Cool. Uh, yeah. Yeah. What you've just yeah. seen is the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. Cool. Like, I mean, I don't know that I get it again just because I played it already. Now it's time to make and. See though, I did always want Gear Heim to get in the Smash. 
Yeah, I've. He always seemed cool, even if he came from like not great humans. But of course, yeah. I mean, that's. I think for most people, actually, those the uh, the most jokes of the week in parts of the game. And now you have well, no, it was that and feet. Yeah, that and your that and your character somehow being more annoying than Abby. Yeah, B. I wonder if they're gonna fix that for this game and make her like pop in a lot less. Because this game has some really cool levels, like that desert level. Yeah, that looks cool. It's one of the most interesting desert desert levels I've seen. No, it's like the sand is an ocean that you sail on and shit, and then there's these stones and you have to convert time and stuff. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, I like that. Swing to the right, to the left. I guess just see, I just see how how frustrating it actually is to do on this. Yeah, how, yeah, it just depends on how well it controls, really. Here's something else. We Ooh, I'm getting them. Specially designed. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. I'm getting that's, them. That's, that's good. good. That's the first Joy Cons that I actually really like. Named after the hiding and shield and master sword. Oh, that's dope. Yeah. July 16th. Nice. I wonder if there's more coming because it feels like they really like stopped for this. And... You'll be able to see those expansions when they each out. And the specially designed joy mm. for a second look like they were holding up. They're on a chain. Local resource. Many of you may already know this, but the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword was the last original console release prior to the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild release, so it was still following the established conventions of the Legend of Zelda. However, a greater glimpse into many features and innovations that would eventually be adopted in the Legend of Zelda. Oh, uh, this thing. Using a shale block to descend in midair. A stamina gauge that depleted as you scaled walls or vines or ramps. Even the concept of collecting items to upgrade gear. I hope those of you who played the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild will give this Also, uh, I will say the soundtrack to go... I could tell. Oh, last game. Okay. Last game. Overwatch? No, it's already out. Yeah, Overwatch is already out. Splatoon 3? This is Splatoon oh. 3. Oh, sure. What? But, like, with a story story mode or something. Oh. Dude, is this Splatoon right after the apocalypse? Oh, like a prequel? Splatoon 3, yeah. Dude! I'm all for that. Let's go. I didn't get a really, Hell good, yeah. I didn't really good chance to play Splatoon proper. I need to get back into it. I <laughs> didn't like playing it. That is awesome. I'd like, now that I have a pro controller, I'd like to go back and play it. I kind of didn't like playing it on the Joy-Cons. Dude, I think this is like kind of a prequel game though, because uh, yeah, I know right the after the, uh, the great... oh, like yeah, right this after the like... apocalypse. This looks like it'll be. I wonder if this is game. entirely story focused, dude. I love a story focused uh, Splatoon. <laughs> Available today. God, that would be sweet. That would be insane. It would. I don't expect that at all. <laughs> no, me either. Not for something like Splatoon. Arguably their biggest new IP. Yeah. Because ARMS didn't take off at all. <laughs> no. I love all the other fish people look so weird. <laughs> Split, the yeah. new flings look so cartoony. Okay, this was really out of left field. Yeah. Me. Yeah, it was. I didn't hear anything about a it possible great Splatoon way. game. Yeah. I figured Splatoon 3 would be coming, but not... Oh. But not like... 
Oh wow. This city. Yeah, it's like the city, but like it's all it's, it's not put together yeah. yet. It's like all destroyed. The dystopian. Yeah. Like I figured Splatoon three would be maybe towards the end of the Switch or like whatever the Switch two or whatever. Another game with great music, by the way. Yes. Splatoon three. You're a yep. kid now. You're a squid now. Oh, it looks like they are keeping the multiplayer. Wait, what? Oh, oh. Okay, how long are you in That's interesting. Now? That's cool. Like you get to control like where you end up. I don't think. <laughs> yeah, could, I don't think you, you could get that. You could control it, but it was pretty. Did you? It was pretty hard to like get an exact spot. But yeah, the core of the game is the same: new weapons, new new styles of outfits and stuff. Of course. Yeah. I guess it makes sense because I know I think Splatoon 2 is starting to get to the end of its life in terms of updates. Well, Splatoon 2 is pretty much ended like, like uh, early last year or the, like late okay. last year for sure. No, they're still doing, they were still doing Splatfests like around Christmas at least. But I was definitely know it was like starting to get you know long in the tooth. Wow. Me too. Mm -hmm. Today, we showed you I have to bust out Splatoon 2 and actually beat the story mode, then start playing online finally. Okay. So. That was good. Yeah, it was a good time. A lot of big announcements, a lot of good announcements. Um, mm -hmm. Plenty of surprises. Yeah, I think the biggest surprise.